Happy Sunday, everybody. This is a pick a card reading for today, Sunday, November 14th. You pick a card, it's your main energy, but I do pull them all together. And November 14th, birthdays, we'll do your reading next. If you pick card number one, you have the two of cups. Nice. Okay, to me, for some of you, something about divine timing, though, okay? There is a spiritual sense to this. Um, decisions, ups and downs, partnerships, and strengthening bonds, yes. The number two is coming up big for me here. This could be forming a business partnership for some of you eventually, and this could be someone you already know, and this could um, include some money coming in, and this could form a new for, um, a new way of making money. New money is coming in. Um, I do feel for some of you, um, if you've been waiting for love or a reconnection with somebody, it may take till, I don't know why I'm picking up June for some reason, okay? Um, a new emotional way of communicating, a new emotional path is showing up here in divine timing, okay? Card number two, you have the seven of cups. Ooh. There's new beginnings here. For some of you, you got, your emotions could be everywhere. You may have some choices and you're like, I don't know what I want, okay? But <clears throat> patience and positive thinking. I don't know why. You're kind of upset about something for some of you is what I'm thinking here, okay? Um, you're just allowing some kind of thoughts to come through your head. Wish is a, a wish or a dream that you had will be fulfilled, even though you don't b believe it. There's a new beginning with it, okay? Card number three, you have a major arcana of strength. Important day for you. Well, you will have to... Take some time alone, meditate, and breathe. I do feel that you're lucky today. Something will be made clear to you. Something may come surprisingly out or somebody blurt something out or a secret's revealed. I do pick up a Capricorn energy here as well. You may have manifested something inadvertently that you didn't even realize, okay? Okay, two of cups, seven of cups, and then we have strength. There's an underlining energy here of trying to keep a balance and harmonious energy is going to be important. We have a new beginning with love, a new love coming through. I do feel um, it's a need to slow down with some things. Don't assume things right away. Don't speak up right away. Um, think before you speak and picking and choosing. And I also feel... We are stronger for it, okay? Um, I do feel we have to balance out energies today, too. Balance out time. This is also decisions. Uh, partnerships are showing up here, too. Um, I do feel there's a sense of, um, I don't know, you're feeling you want to get something, or you got some wishes, and maybe there is um, a lack of money or money worries, but uh, I see blessings coming in. Uh, and new beginnings, and I do feel here manifestation is really high. There could be some talks and commitments made today, dealing with institutions today for some reason or people or groups of people. Um, rebirthing, I feel a sense of rebirthing, okay? Um, there is a new beginning here. Something maybe we're contemplating could be very heavy on our mind. We're not sure if we're going to do it, but it's a new beginning, and there's new love here. I feel there's a new love. Um, take a break, rest, let things just unfold, and then you can make some decisions. And I do feel that a lot of things that we're thinking or wanting or maybe even starting up today is a new beginning coming towards the maybe next month um, or a few weeks from now. We may take a leap of faith today, okay? A wish will come to fruition, um, picking up an Aquarius energy too. And I do feel a lot of things are going to work out better than what we thought. Okay. 
I see some blessings coming in too. Blessings aren't present. All right. All right. So that is the reading for today. Um, September, September, maybe something from September. I meant to say November 14th, Sunday. I hope you have a wonderful day. Happy birthday if you're born today, November 14th. This is a very quick and general reading. This is your solar, your theme, and your wish card. And your solar, your theme is the major arcana of the tower. Okay. Well, some things just were not built firmly, okay? I really do feel this um, extraction. So it's extracting things, sudden changes. Um, things were not stable. And this is with either contracts you had, with uh, negotiations, or with some, with matters of the heart, or even desires, okay? So I do feel that energy. It's a year of a um, lot of action. There's a healing energy. There's new beginnings. Uh, there's a focus also on the finances here, too. And... This is like breaking down even relationships, making sure that we're making these spiritual connections and partnerships. You've got a strong healing energy. There's some things you need to take action with. If it's been a very, if you've been um, in a sedentary mode, you're going to be more active. Um, so I do feel that energy. Um, there can be some sudden changes with um, um, love. Um, health and well-being is definitely showing up here. A recovery period. Keeping things more to yourself. Secrets could be revealed. There's a lot of changes. Kind of expect big sudden changes. Sometimes beyond your control. Um, there's a recovery period here too. Separating from things that no longer serve us as well. You're going to have to rest a lot this year too. Take as much rest as you can. When it comes to work, career, and um, school... Um, I do see some of you may be going, um, maybe your company will go to another location. Um, it's a possibility there's a change of location with your job, meaning they move companies. Um, maybe you have to travel for work. For some of you, maybe a finding another job in a different location, um, going to school in another location. There's some travel involved here or some kind of um, a change of location. Some difficulties here, you're going to be leaving behind you. So I do see that, okay? Finances. I do feel that this there is a big focus on your finances as well. Um, I do see a lot of opportunities coming to make money this year. New beginnings with finances. If, you're, if you are um, love, if you are single, I do feel you're attracting a lot into your life. Um, so also you got to keep your boundaries up and there is a, I think, it, um, I want to say you will attract somebody who actually physically you're both like very appealing and, and you kind of are a match. Okay. That's the best I can explain. If you are in a relationship, um, <clears throat> you may not be always on the same page. There can be some conflicts um, there can be sometimes um, this energy that you or your partner could be overly defensive at times. There are things that you're going to have to make adjustments in the relationship. Okay, there are some changes or changes of perspective there. For all relationships, I feel that there is new people coming in, new path. Um, you may find a love through a relationship, uh, through a friendship, but I do see a new beginning. Things are changing definitely strong new beginnings okay your wish card for your soul your another major arcana is judgment okay for some of you um there's a yes and and a no it's like almost a partial fulfillment here it can be with um comes with a lot of conflict for some of you. This has got to do with the relationship and love. There's a new love connected, um, talks of marriage or commitments, um, manifestation. Make sure that you uh, you're careful what you do wish for. Um, there is divine timing here, and maybe some of it you'll see some kind of sparks of miracles or something coming with it that will lead to um a completion to the wish. That is the best I can explain that. <laughs> All right, um, the important numbers for your solar year. Three, five, one, 55, 27, 48, 
six sixty six four twenty five twenty and eleven. I hope you have a wonderful birthday and a wonderful solar year ahead and beyond. Everyone else, a wonderful Sunday, and bye for now.